Good day, ladies and gents. All right, so uh, I am out sick today um, and probably will be for the next week due to crazy things. All right, so let's talk about what you guys are going to be doing for the next while. All right, so we go to daily schedules. Here is what you guys are in charge of. All right, so um, here is the videos. So, uh, and you guys can always go to important links and if you want to go ahead and just take all the notes, that's fine. Um, so here are the videos right there. But if you go to daily schedules, what you guys are in charge of right now. Okay, so you guys are going to be doing pages two through five and all this is going to be due on Friday. So you're going to take notes on pages two and three, which is on video one. And then you guys are going to do the team's assignments. Now I broke it down into little parts so that you can just do a little bit here and then see if you're getting it right before you instead of doing like an entire page and finding out you did the entire page wrong. It's just little things. So you're going to do page four, which is just a little check, and then you're going to see if you guys got it right or wrong, and then you guys can move on and do the uh, finish up page four, which is the home learning. All right, and then um, uh, and then same thing with page five. There's a little check and then there's the then you finish up the problems. OK, and then you guys are going to be doing pages six through nine. So um, you're watching video two and that's part of page three and part of page six. Then you're going to do the team's assignment. And once again, I broke it up into little parts. Remember, no work, no credit. So make sure you show all your work on your packet. OK, so page six, numbers one and two, then page six, numbers three and four and so on and so forth. And yes, page uh, number uh, five and six were skipped. That was on purpose. No, no big deal there. All right, so where do you find these assignments? Well, if you go to assignments. Here they are, so here are all those assignments right there. Um, so make sure you guys go to the right ones or you can go to general and those pop up as well. So um, and it's right there. So and they're all in order. All right, so you would click on that assignment. Boop. All right, let's see. No one's done it yet because I just handed it out, but this is what you guys would see. All right, remember, no, sh no, you have to show all your work, so no work, no credit. So if you click on that, it will take you to here. It shows you what page you're on, just in case you actually got, got confused as to what page you're on. Um, uh, please uh, note that um, these are just multiple choice right here. And the little um, question mark right there, that's because I don't have a square root button on my on my keyboard, so I'm just using a, a question mark instead of a square root button. So just putting that out there. OK, so um, so X, what would you have labeled as? So here's the picture, right? So I know for 45, 45, 90, this is X, this is X, and this is X radical 2. So your black X, we labeled that side as X, so we click that. And then um, what did you label Y as? What did we label Y as? This right here would be X radical 2. So X radical 2. And then what did you label the black 4 as? That would have been labeled as X. So I just want to I want to know what you would label each one as. OK, so you would do that to all of them um, and then you would submit it and then it should tell you uh, if you got stuff right or wrong. If you got it wrong, fix it, fix it immediately and then you would move on to the next question. All right, so then let's go back. All right, so now if we do the next assignment, which is the home learning. Do, do, do. All right, so you guys would see this once again, no work, no credit, right? So show your work on your on your packets. All right, so we click on this. So it's the same question as before. Now, please remember, uh, so no spaces. So when you type these out, no spaces, use a question mark for the radical and then the little fraction bar um, for uh, for a fraction. So for example, if you're doing 12 square root of three, it'd be 12 square root of 12 and then a question mark three. And then this would be three radical two all over four. So just in case you want some examples of how to type this out. All right, so on this one um, for X, so we've already done this in class, uh, some of us. All right, so I know that this is four, this is four, and this is uh, four radical two. So for X, I would type in the number four. And for Y, I found a four radical two. So four, and then I put a question mark two. And that's how you would type that in. And you would just do that for all the problems. And then when you're done, you would submit it and see if you got stuff right or wrong. 
All right, so hopefully that, that answered your questions. All right, so um, let's go back to the daily schedule here. All right, so uh, you would do that for all of these, um, and then the same thing for these uh, for the rest of these pages right here. So you'd watch the video, get a nice refresher, and then you would do these. And all this is due on Friday. I'm gonna be keeping up with knowing if you guys are working on your stuff. If you're not turning anything in, I'm gonna mark you as absent. So make sure at the very least today, you should get all of pages four and five done not that hard and then um, tomorrow you're going to be doing uh, pages six through seven so this is all due friday so wednesday and thursday as long as you're working on something i'm happy and that's about it um if you guys have any questions please remember you guys can uh email me or sorry not, well you can email me but the fastest way to get a hold of me is through text um and you guys most of you guys already have my cell phone number but just in case you guys don't um, it is 904-419-9910. Uh, so if you guys need anything, just contact me uh, through text or you guys can message me on Teams, whatever uh, whatever uh, floats your boat. But um, the text is much faster because I'll probably be sleeping from my illness. All right, so hopefully that helped you guys out and good luck. Let's see, now I just have to end the recording. <laughs>